I'm Rachel Long, Farm Advisor with UC Cooperative Extension in Yolo County, and in this video I'm going to show you how to recognize caterpillars that have been parasitized by tiny wasps. Alfalfa caterpillars, western yellow-striped armyworms, and beet armyworms are key pests of alfalfa. Although these pests can cause significant economic damage to alfalfa, it's not always necessary to use pesticides to get rid of them. There are naturally occurring parasites and predators in the field that can help reduce caterpillar numbers so that you can avoid unnecessary pesticide use. Regular monitoring of your field for the presence of alfalfa caterpillars and armyworms is essential for making good management decisions. To record the data about caterpillars collected in your sweep net, use the monitoring form which can be downloaded from the UC IPM website. When inspecting the net, first toss out any caterpillars smaller than a half inch. Then identify and count the numbers of each species that you have. Alfalfa caterpillars have velvety green bodies with prominent white lines along the sides. Armyworms are smooth skinned and are either green or black with yellow stripes down the sides of their body. The next step is to determine how many of the caterpillars are healthy or parasitized. It's not easy to do this by just looking at them. Can you see any differences in this group? Probably not. To confirm whether a caterpillar is parasitized, pull the body apart. Parasitized caterpillars contain wasp larvae that are whitish or translucent green in color. Record the numbers of healthy and parasitized alfalfa caterpillars and armyworms using the monitoring form. Consider application of insecticides when there is an average of 10 or more non-parasitized alfalfa caterpillars per sweep, 15 or more non-parasitized armyworms per sweep, or 10 or more combined non-parasitized alfalfa caterpillars and armyworms per sweep. Remember, unnecessary pesticide applications are costly and may harm natural enemies of many pests. For more information, visit Alfalfa Pest Management Guidelines at the University of California Statewide Integrated Pest Management Program website.